Hello, this is Alistair Goodell from GT Driving School here. This is my next Ashford video um, regarding the roundabouts from the uh, Drover's roundabout um, to um, the uh, Tower um, School. So, uh, first of all, we've got to sort of get to the Drover's um, roundabout. So, we're just keeping an eye on things as we go down the road. I'm going to need to change lanes, so I'm going to check main and right, indicate right. And I'm basically following signs for M20 at the moment, so the right hand lane. And then I'm going to keep in the left of the two lanes here, and we've got a red light. So we're going to slow it down and brake and stop at the white line. So just make sure you don't go over those white lines at the end of the road at the at the uh, traffic lights you don't want to be uh, you know getting your tire on it or over it keep your distance okay everything's fine we're keeping on the left because we're now going to be turning left m20 is off to the left a20 m20 as it says on the road going round Two lanes up ahead, we're sticking to the left for the time being. We're going to have some more signage up ahead in a minute, telling us about where we're going. And M20 is the third exit. Basically means I'm in the wrong lane, so I'm going to need to check main and right, indicate right to move to the right, and I want lane three of four here. So the Lane one goes off to the left. Then you've got A20 Lenham and two for the M20. Now because we've got four lanes here and one of them, the number one, peels off, there are going to be three lanes at the next set of traffic lights. And I'm going to be in the middle of those three lanes. So as and when the lights change, hopefully I'm all I'm going to do is really sort of follow the guy in front which can be a help. Not everybody does what they should do, so it's always a case of you know, being careful and cautious about following other road users. But you may find it useful at times to know where your lanes are. So I'm just moving off in a nice gentle way, keeping my distance. M20 is the middle lane. I'm now being pushed over by the white lines over to the left keep on going left and we've got a red light up ahead so gently on the brake so I'm now find myself in the left of three lanes and I'm going in effect straight ahead towards the M20 so I'm just looking around everything's fine moving on keeping on the left Lights up ahead have just turned green, which means we can go through. Just sticking for the in, in the left lane for now. And I'm just going to stay in this lane because we now have an additional lane to your left, which is for turning left on the M20. I don't want that. I'm going to stick in the lane that I am now in, which is currently lane two out of four. We've got green lights at the moment on the roundabout. I'm now keeping on the outside edge of the roundabout. All looking good. Moving on, keeping in our lane under the bridge. And we're going to take the next turning left. So checking main and left, indicating left. Make sure you stay in your lane, don't cut corners. Round you go. Next roundabout, we've got three lanes on the entrance of this roundabout. We really should be in the middle of the three. So I'm just following the white line that's in the middle of the road. Backing off, waiting for the white car. Then I'm going back on the left-hand side, just keeping an eye on the silver car behind us. Main and left, indicating left. Still a 40 mile an hour speed limit, so I'm just pushing on a little bit. 
Keeping my distance though from the car in front allows me to see what I'm doing, making my own decisions. I'm doing 37 miles an hour, that's fine. Straight ahead at this next roundabout, second exit, keeping on the left hand side, looking to the right, all looks pretty good. Keeping on the left, main and left, indicating left. Round we go. There we are. Pushing on again. Still a 40 mile an hour speed limit, but we have got traffic lights up ahead. They're green at the moment. We're going straight on. But the light speed limit changes now to 30, so I'm just backing off under 30 now. Going straight ahead, second exit. Looking to the right, nothing coming. Keeping on the outside, main and left, indicating left. Around we go. Yeah. Again, keeping it under 30. Taking our time. should be going faster but nope you can't if you're not sure what the speed limit is on a road check it out see if you see any speed limit signs if you can't and you've got street lights it must be a 30 triangle sign on the left tells me it's a roundabout uh, coming up we're going straight ahead at that roundabout keeping on the left looking to the right all clear and at the traffic lights up ahead we're turning right so we're going to check main and right indicating upwards Keeping in the right hand lane. Now I've decided to indicate at this point uh, we don't have to because it's a right only lane. But we do find that sometimes it's easier to tell there that other people what you're up to. Sometimes it makes it clearer for yourself as well. Lights are turning green, checking around us, waiting for everybody else to move on. There we go, and past Tower School.